Okay, that's probably the campest wave I have ever done. Hello there guys, hi, how are you all doing? So, this is the second Christmas Eve video that I'm doing. And this one, I'm just going to be talking about the Christmas songs that I like to listen to, obviously, in this festive season, and to talk about some of my Christmassy memories. Hopefully, guys, you will like it. If you do, as always, please like, subscribe, and all that lovely festival goodness. So, as you heard just then, the first song that was playing was... Just need to actually check I said it right. Fairy Tale of New York, the, I am never actually know how you say this, the Pogues, the Pukes, the Pogues, you know the one I mean, what I was playing in the intro. I absolutely adore this song. It is one of these songs which, boom, I feel like the festive season is approaching, it is beautiful to listen to, and it's just, it's just festive, it's just nice and easy and calm to listen to, and it just, it gets me in the mood, as soon as I hear the intro, I'm like, boom, Christmas is coming, bitches, Santa is on his sleigh, ho, 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 it can't be Christmas, it wouldn't, sorry, be Christmas without one man, do, 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 do. Michael Bublé, now, the thing about him is, and it's absolutely true, he will release a Christmas album, hibernate for the rest of the year, and come out at Christmas time again. The only time I've actually heard from him this year, or seen him, was when he did a duet with Adina Menzel, Rachel Berry's mum and Frozen Lady, and then left again. I, 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 he's great. I love his renditions of Jingle Bells, Santa Claus is Coming to Town, Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas. His soulful voice. It just makes me want to sit in front of the fire with my dressing gown, with my Christmas hat, with my slippers, couple of biscuits, couple of mince pies, and just watch a shitload of Christmas films for the evening. His voice is absolutely gorgeous. I love that man to bits. No homo. Now, another Christmas song, which is just beautiful, is Do They Know It's Christmas Time? And I'm not talking about the 2013 Band Aid. One, I, 13, I mean this year, 14, I am talking about the very original one, the 1984 version. That one, I think to me, is just the classic. No one can replace it. All right, there's been, there's been two more since then. There's been the one with Busted and now the one with One Direction. Nothing in my eyes can beat the first one. It is just the perfect Christmassy song. It's, it's, it's happy in this weird way, although it's for quite a sad cause. It's a nice, uplifting song. Oh! Last Christmas, classic. Shaking Stevens, Merry Christmas. Everyone, bum, 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 bum. Strangely enough, I like to listen to Stay Another Day by E17 towards Christmas time. It's a weird one, that, because I don't really deem it as a Christmas song, yet it's one of them songs which plays only at Christmas. I kind of actually like it, although it is sad and depressing, and they're just walking around in snow and doing weird stuff in the music video. <coughs> <coughs> oh shit, I'm having a... T Sorry. <coughs> okay, carry <coughs> carrying on. Step Into Christmas by Elton John. When I first heard that song, only last year, it was an instant smile on my face. It's beautiful. Of course, Mariah Carey's All I Want For Christmas Is You. It is on my Christmas playlist all the time. Not just during Christmas. During halfway through summer, I'll be like, baby, this year what I want for Christmas is you. Roll song. Da -da 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 -da. Leona Lewis, One More Sleep. Now, that was she released that last year, and I think that's just a classic Christmas song already. Boom, perfect. It's just that intro got me when she's like, snow is falling all around us. Perfect song, perfect Christmas song. If you've not heard it, I do recommend you give it a listen. A lot of you are probably going to give me hate now, but I heard Britney Spears release a Christmas song the other day. I don't actually know what it was called, but it was kind of fascinating to listen to. And I want to listen to it again. No rendition of Justin Bieber's Christmas songs are even on my list. There's so many Christmas songs to think about. Slade, Wizard, is it Wizard? Oh, hang on. The Darkness is Christmas song. Christmas time! Turn it to Belvedere! That one. That was a bit weird, sorry guys. But Christmas is just this happy time and 
And I've missed a lot of songs out there, but it's just nice. Christmas is nice. And I'll tell you, I'm going to finish it off with a Christmas memory here. So what, or what happens every year. What I love about Christmas is that every year, me and my family will have our Christmas lunch. And then at the end of that, we will get presents that have been given to us from our relatives. We'll pile them all together, go into the living room, whatever, and we'll dish them all out to each other one by one. So let's say the present says to my dad. I will get, we'll, that present will go to my dad and all of us will watch my dad open the present. Doesn't sound exactly amazing, but to me and to my family that is amazing because yes, my dad's in his 40s. I'd like to say, old oh, man, he's not old. Sorry, dad, I love you to bits, man. He is not old and you know what I mean? He's in his 40s and it's just nice to still see his face light up when he gets something. You'd think that novelty would wear off, but it doesn't. And it just puts a smile on my face thinking, this is why Christmas is magical. It does genuinely bring everyone together. And that's one of the happiest things I can think of right now. Or in general, just that togetherness, that happiness. Just enjoying yourself because I think we all need a little bit of festive spirit this year. I want to finish it off by showing you what my friend got me the other day. No, this is my Christmas card he sent me, or gave me, for a special little boy. Brilliant. Cheers, Jared, mate. Thanks, buddy. Thank you very much. <laughs> right, so that's concludes the video. I'm not exactly sure if you've liked today's video, but I have actually really enjoyed talking about these Christmas songs I listen to and Christmas memories. As always, I have baffled on a, a lot. <laughs> But thanks for sticking with me until the end if you have. Take care, guys, and make sure you follow me on everything social media. Everything down below, as always. I will see you very soon for my Christmas dub set video. And then I've got a Christmas message for you all, which will be broadcasted, feel like the Queen, on Christmas Day. Take care, guys. Well, love you all.